What's up guys, welcome to a brand new video. I'm Ambassador Zimmy with the Xbox Ambassador Program and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to enable energy saving mode on your Xbox One console and then also explaining what exactly does it do. Now before we jump too far into this video, I just want to say real quick that if you guys enjoy this video, if it helps you out or if you learn anything new, please make sure to hit that like button and share this video with your friends. Also, if you guys never want to miss out on any of my Xbox tutorials, game trailers, or just general Xbox news, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. So to start off with, let me go ahead and show you guys how to activate the energy saving mode on your Xbox One console, and then I'll explain what exactly it does and why you might or might not want to do it. So to activate the energy saving mode on your Xbox One console, you're going to want to press the Xbox button on your controller to open up the guide menu. Then scroll over here to the settings gear icon, come down and select settings. Once you guys are on the main settings page, just go ahead and scroll down here on the left hand side to power and start up. Come right over here, scroll down and select power mode and start up. Once on the power and start up page, go ahead and scroll over here to the center column and select the power mode icon. You should then have the option to select energy saving mode. Now the biggest reason why you would want to actually switch to energy saving mode is that it does use 30 times less energy than instant on. Instant on mode uses about 15 watts of power, while energy saving mode just uses 0.5 watts of power. So it's definitely easy to say that using energy saving mode on your Xbox One console will definitely save you a bit of money on your electric bill. Now with this being said, using energy saving mode does have a couple of drawbacks. It's definitely not as convenient as instant on in the sense that your console will not automatically download updates whenever you turn it off. You also will not be able to use voice commands to turn on the console if you have an Xbox One Connect, and it will take longer for the console to initially start up whenever you turn it on. It can take around 45 seconds for your console to start up while on energy saving mode. Anyway guys, that's going to be pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, if it helped you out, or if you learned anything new, please make sure to hit that like button and share this video with your friends. Also, if you guys never want to miss out on any of my Xbox tutorials, game trailers, or just general Xbox news, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, if you guys have any questions about the energy saving mode or the instant on power mode, please make sure to put all of those questions in the comment section below and I will do my best to respond to those as quickly as I can. Like always, thank you guys so very much for watching this video. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Peace out guys.